Well, good morning, everybody. <laughs> we are back at it. I uh, got a couple turns in a row, and this is turn number two. I got one more left. Should be the last of uh, my time in the right seat. Maybe. We'll see. But today we get to fly with uh, someone that we've flown with quite a bit. Uh, I'll let him introduce himself again. But uh, one of the, yeah, again, you know, getting ready to go to the left seat. I'm not going to get to fly with some of my good buds who are, who are captains right now. So I'm trying to, we're trying to trade and slip into each other's trips. And uh, but it'll be good. Let's go. guys it's early <laughs> it is early uh i'm not gonna tell you what time i woke up but it had a three in front of it ow you'll see why in a minute oh well, i was gonna say something funny about who i'm flying with but he's not here unusual unusual about him he's usually very very uh prompt and he is actually applying to the Czech Airmen seat. Is that a thing? Czech Airmen seat. He's applying to become a Czech Airman. So uh yeah we'll see him here in a second. But I'm gonna get this thing ready although it's kinda up so that's kinda unusual. Let's see. Oh well, I take that back. His bag is here and he's out briefing the uh the flight attendant. So everything I said about him because he's gonna watch this take Take that away. Uh, he's, you know, look, he's actually got a lot of my stuff going. Yeah, I was running not my usual early uh, today, so. Let's talk to him in a second. I'm gonna get my stuff ready. One thing I love about the Phoenix mornings, it is just gorgeous. But I'll say that's uh, probably one minor uh, benefit to waking up this early in the morning because during the summer the sun comes up right about 5 15 what time is it it is 5 10 right now so it's it's just starting to just starting to peak above but i gave up a nice port of ir to turn gentlemanly show time of eight something to fly with my boy you've known him captain kelly <laughs> Hi everybody, what a good friend he yeah. is, isn't he? How many guys would give up a leisurely morning start to come fly with me, wake up at 3am to be here at a 4.30am show time? Oh. Alex, we're going to be done by 12.10 uh, today and go to Houston and back, so kind of a big day, but you know, early break gets the worm, I guess they say. Right? Well, you, and you know, to quote a good friend of mine, JK, who I'm, we're close in seniority, so we're going to upgrade, but not in the same class. Nothing says thank you like a free lunch. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. This is true. Everything's on me today, Big Earth. Hey, they are, you heard it. You heard it. You said everything. So, <laughs> uh, we're going to make this lunch really good. <laughs> Anything at Chick-fil-A that you want. Anything at Chick-fil-A. You been to Mochi? Yes, we did. Or wherever. Yeah. Yesterday I had chicken play. Oh. Chicken that's play right. breakfast sandwiches. Okay. Because we're getting there at breakfast time, so we're getting there early. So we're gonna we're gonna finish getting our briefing going on, talk about everything and then we'll uh, we'll pick his brain again. Because you know Kelly's got some good knowledge on everything. I don't know about that. So <laughs> see you guys in a minute. Clips on phase then it's foul. Found to eight thousand feet. I guess I should tell you where we're going. We're going to Houston today. Uh, and then uh, we're gonna change planes and then fly on back. Um, but here's our route uh, we're doing to hit phase, uh, the departure hitting phase, and then uh, basically straight down over San Antonio and then over to Houston. But uh, that's the route, clips on phase, as followed, 8,000 feet for a squawk of 2606, that's down there. Altitude to 8,000 feet because we're departing off of runway 26, actually. Most likely we're departing off 26 and the 8,000 feet restriction is the top altitude. 
but if you notice in this clearance, it's maintained 8,000. So there's no climb beat on this one. Um, we just throw 8,000 in there, but it just happens to be 8,000 on that partial plate too. Uh, two hours, six minutes is what it's gonna take us, 39,000 feet. And that's it. So, Kelly, what would you like to talk about today? Kelly, by the way, is interviewing for Czech German position. So, how are we doing, gents? Doing good. Doing good. We got 187 on the gas. Cool. Perfect. And there's all your documents. Thank you, sir. All the right. So we give him plenty of good luck. I'm sure he's gonna make it. Um. Yeah. He's gonna make it. So Kelly, what do you want to talk about? You know, I thought we'd talk about today. My my daughter is uh, going through. Um, the uh, training process in order to hopefully eventually see her dad today. UND. UND. She goes huh? to UND yeah. at the uh, Mesa Gateway campus, so it's in conjunction with uh, Chandler Gilbert Community College. So currently uh, she finished her instrument rating in May and now is uh, hard charging forward and she decided to go ahead and do summer classes and work on her commercial ratings and the commercial classes through summer, which is brutal here in Arizona considering like yesterday I got to 106. <laughs> um, so what we want to talk about today is really being dedicated, perseverance, don't let minor hiccups or uh, maybe sometimes difficulty uh, or boredom slow you down. Because uh, it is a long process. It is a long process, it's a long road. I mean, honestly, it, it's, it's like becoming a doctor or an attorney. Uh, good things don't come easy. So you have to work really hard at those, uh, at becoming a physician or an attorney, and, and the same thing applies here in order to become a successful aviator. So um, yeah, we want to talk a little bit about that and uh, keep moving forward, keep staying focused and uh, being dedicated. And eventually the end result is what we're achieving today, being able to fly a commercial airline with your best buddy, <laughs> Uh, doing an out and back. So, how awesome is that? Yeah. So, we'll talk a little bit about that a little later, okay? All right. Thanks, nice Kill. Oh. Um, man, yeah, it, there's so much hiring going on right now. And, man, we get it. The, uh, the process to get here is well, long and hard, right? But you are rewarded at the end. So, uh, if you're in that training process right now, um, UND, you know, any of the flight schools out there, you know, it's, it's going to take a little bit. To get to all your ratings and you're going to flight instruct and you got to go through the whole deal so uh just keep that perseverance in there know that there is light at the end of the tunnel which that light's getting ready to come up here in phoenix so keep hustling you know what i talk about right humble hungry keep flying all right guys we're going to get ready to take off and head over to uh houston we'll see you there well we're here in houston just pulled up gate number 50. I think Kelly did pretty good on the landing. You know, it was a little squirrely. The winds are, you know, whenever it's like kind of light, you know, like five knots and it's shifting, I think that's the hardest landing. Yeah, what was it, the 160 at 10? Really, it almost felt like it was gusty winds the way, uh, the, way the winds were today. But, yeah. Um, Not too bad. I think it all turned out pretty smooth. Uh, I give you a six and a half, maybe seven. Six? Is this out of seven? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you gotta give a, you gotta give some love that way, right? All right, uh, two eleven and two twenty seven was our block. Um, we basically landed on runway one three right on here. A lot of taxiway uh, stuff, so landed there. Uh, Mike three to Mike, the whole short of that runway of two two, and then got clearance across, and then hotel the whole short of this runway, which. Okay, and then uh, on in. So it was definitely pay attention day because if you miss a runway hold short deal, it's bad juju. Anyways, we're gonna get the airplane all cleaned up and then uh, we're gonna head over to the next airplane, which is a Max, and we get to fly that back home. So, and uh, most likely my last flight as an FO in the Max with my buddy Kelly. <laughs> Should be an outstanding experience. Yes, but first Chick-fil-A. First Chick-fil-A with a milkshake. With a milkshake, milkshake, maybe. 
Maybe, I know. Here we are, and we are in Almax. So, eventually the last leg I will have as a first officer until they demote me back to first officer <laughs> And he still didn't do the walk around. You believe that? I know. And you got the walk around twice. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> so, anyways, we're, we're at a max, as you guys can see. Nice big screens up in front of us. And we're going to take this home to Phoenix. Um, just getting this thing rolling right now. So... Doing our final checks. We did get the uh, ATC prop, so we have our clearance. Let's take a look at that. I retire seven to junction, then I spile 5,000 feet, so we'll put five right there. And we'll spec 36 and 10, 2667, and 6776. Five to sevens. Hi there. We're flying this one back. And Ground control for taxi, okay. Got there, we've got the uh, route page up on that. And that's it, should be two hours, 16 minutes, 36,000 feet. The route looks awfully like the one we just did. Just reverse it. So, um, straight out to basically junction, and then from there, pick up the uh, ping arrival into Phoenix. We'll call it a day. I, technically, I have one more uh, one more turn tomorrow. It's a late one, but uh, I put it up into giveaway, so hopefully uh, someone's looking to make some extra money. <laughs> I'll pick that up. Otherwise, this is the last one, last last FO trip. It's a monumental day. Monumental. Uh, Kelly did buy the lunch, by the way. So nothing nothing says thank you like a uh, free lunch. <laughs> <laughs> JK. I'm just getting him prepared to what he's about to experience. That's true. He's flying with a bunch of new guys. You know, it's culture here that we take care of our new folks, our new first officers. So it's customary to at least buy them maybe some beverages, but uh, we'll go the extra mile. We'll just let them buy them some lunches, buy them some dinners, because, you know, you're not killing it the first year, but you're still doing pretty good. But it's nice to go ahead and spread the, uh, spread the love. I like that. Yeah, I, I took advantage of that. Well, I take advantage that it, it was very much appreciated my first year here uh, when you know, you're going for the military, make a decent money to uh, your first year at an airline, which, you know, nowadays it's pretty good. Yeah, and it's great. Back back then it was, back in our day. I took a big pay cut. We did. Uh, probably a $100,000 pay cut to, to start. Yeah. I don't think it would be that much. I don't think so either. Yeah, it pays much better now. Yeah. And it's getting better and better. Better so. contract, better As it pay. should be. As it should be. So. Sure. All right, guys. Uh, you saw the clearance. We're going to head on back to Phoenix, and uh, we'll see you guys there. Uh, gate Delta 2. So it's a good gate for us to get out of here. <laughs> so it might be the last one. Kelly, thanks again. Always uh, great always flying with you, bigger. Yeah. Uh, by the way, guys, it was his landing today. I'm giving him a 2 <laughs> out, out of, of four. 10. <laughs> two out of ten. Two out of ten. No, two. really, it was a it was a nine out of ten. It was a great oh, landing. Yeah. Good flight. Yeah. Awesome. Make awesome sure you job. keep that grading scale up when you become a check airman. Yeah. Well, we'll see. I got to pass an interview first, so let's not count our chickens. <laughs> yeah. uh, who knows? I may not even get called for the interview. Yeah. I submitted paper. That's, that's all I did, folks. We're gonna wish them best of luck. So. Well, thank Anyways. you. It was awesome flying with you. Yeah. Great career as an FO. It's been Happy good. to see you move over to yeah. see exciting times it's a lot of fun sitting over no, here I appreciate that. especially when you get to fly with your buddies that's true that's true all right guys and for all of you keep hustling out there keep grinding we do appreciate you guys watching the channel so this channel's for you guys um we'll have another video maybe next week uh depends on if i have to fly that trip tomorrow or not i have any giveaway so someone please pick it up <laughs> all right guys we'll see you